into grocery day like like a professional bodybuilder. <laughs> Looking good. <laughs> This one is Nicole, that one is the Sauce Meister. Welcome to the fanciest grocery haul in the whole land. Wow, those hips don't lie, I tell you. They never lie. <laughs> well, and guess what? This grocery haul is the best one because it's an extravaganza. Because right now, in the quarantine, you gotta go to several different grocery stores. So this is grocery store one. Welcome to the party. We're making do with what certain stores have and we're gonna show you what we got. It's an adventure and we're getting creative and it's actually pretty fun. Right now eggs are pretty limited so we've been picking up the 18 pack and that's been lasting us quite a while. So this is great and the dates are quite long so we have a while to eat them. We picked up the creamy cashew unsweetened vanilla milk, non-dairy milk. This is our favorite. We're still able to find berries right now, so we picked up a four berry blend, which has strawberries, raspberries, blueberries, and blackberries. Some weeks, in previous weeks, they only had the blueberries, but that's fine with us. It's, it's a good mix for our body. We always say if we find something different, a different fruit, a different veggie, it'll help our bodies anyways, because you should be switching up your veggies and fruits. Exactly, and right now we're switching up our proteins. What was available this week, there's some tuna, and we like to get the Chunk Light Tuna, the Skipjack in water. Not in oil, always the one in water. And we prefer the name brand because it tastes better than the no-name, but we would get the no-name if we had to. So we've got five, one, two, three, four, five. Um, where, where, where'd you learn how to count? Cooking school? <laughs> we have six. <laughs> and we're... And that's enough for six days because we're splitting the cans, so that's quite a good amount of meat for us. And then... Nicole gets the can, I get the tuna. <laughs> Hank, your dad is being sassy again. So, the Kylie Bear, the Sassmeister discovered these. This is great. They had tons of these at Walmart. Eight burgers for like $7.00. These are chicken burgers and the macros on them, we don't count macros, but we always check to have an idea. For one of them, it's 22 grams of protein, it says on the back. It's four grams of fat, 130 calories, no added sugar, just a bit of sodium, but we don't worry about sodium. And there wasn't any other meat. And right now, even if there is meat sometimes, the grocery stores are tr trying to charge you like an arm and a leg for them. Yeah, I don't know if it's the same everywhere, but in Canada, the meat sales, they're not that great right now. So to get eight burgers for under a dollar a piece at such good macros like that, that's amazing. So we stocked up, we got four boxes of these. So the tuna and the burgers will be our protein this week. And we're gonna get a few toppings for those in the extravaganza at a second grocery store because they didn't have any yet. Uh, we were out of spices, cinnamon and black pepper we use pretty much every day. And we got two black peppers and one cinnamon. This is our favorite dressing right now. This is the Olive Garden light Italian dressing. This stuff is amazing, especially when you're dieting, you need a spice of life. It, re it really does add flavor. Yeah, and you need a spice of life and there it is. <sighs> okay. And... <laughs> We need some treats during the week. So right now, Jello is three for five dollars. That's a steal, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, that's the greatest deal ever, ladies and gentlemen. And we always get the five calories per cup Jello cups. And lime is our favorite, but we always get strawberry because we like the spice of life. And these are these are also no sugar jellos yes so they're five calories per cup no fat no carbs no sugar one protein this is the jam but jello but jello <laughs> and to go with it this stuff is this is also the spice of life 
<laughs> we love this stuff. This is the 95% fat-free Cool Whip. You get three tablespoons. We always do gigantic heaping scoops and it is amazing. It tastes so good. It makes you feel like you're having like a super good dessert that's like full of sugar and stuff. And it's not, it's great. We got two of these natural crunchy peanut butters. Only peanuts. There we go. Looks like uh, peanuts and bears. Yep. Leave the dad jokes <laughs> to dad. Yeah. I don't even have to say it anymore. <laughs> Leave the dad jokes to dad, right, Hank? <laughs> two egg whites because we've been, you're only allowed to get two egg whites at a time right now. So we've been getting a couple every time we go out and that allows us enough for the week. Yogurt, we got three of the, um, the one with lactose, I guess you call it. We got three of these kind. They're called lactose full. Lactose full. These are the plain fat free Greek yogurt. Now with more lactose. However, they, they only had three of those. So we got an, another one, a fourth one with the lactose free. We don't like purposely eat the lactose free. We just buy whatever they have. And right now you take what you can get. Yeah, so we have three lactose full and one lactose free, and they are all plain fat-free Greek yogurt. Lactose extra and lactose <laughs> mild <laughs> and lactose smooth. <laughs> you could uh, market your own products there. Only if they have lactose in them. And we have 1% cottage cheese. We have five of these, and those are great. They go with the, uh, the jelly old peanut butter. Yep. And then this is our favorite sugar-free syrup, although it's called No Sugar Added. It's the Mrs. Butterworths, and this stuff is delicioso. So most of this was from Walmart. These three bajingas here are from Real Canadian Superstore in jolly old Canada. So. What about the Frosted Flakes? Oh my gosh, I forgot. We did get one treat for cheat day. We've got some Frosted Flakes. They were on sale. And this is, this is Sassmeister's favorite cereal. Let us know down below. What is your favorite cereal? Put it down. First of all, you notice anything? What? Oh, I got it a little loopy and I cut my own hair. <laughs> you couldn't wait. Look at this. I did my own hairdressing school. Pretty good. Pretty good for my first time. Yeah. Let's eat the groceries now. Okay, so the friends, we usually get Brussels sprouts, but they were out. So we got this California vegetable blend. It's got broccoli, cauliflower, and baby carrots. This is my favorite kind of bread right now for making French toast and tuna sandwiches. However, they did not have the whole wheat that I usually buy. So this is the white thin sandwich bread by Wonder Bread. Got a loaf of that. We got Hellman's half the fat mayo. Mayonnaise type dressing. Yep. You got sea salt, fine sea salt. We got a prepared yellow mustard. Not unprepared, prepared. Yep. Prepared. You know what's sad when they don't have a name? Yeah, why wouldn't you name your baby? Let's uh, come on mustard, it's okay. Two baby spinach. Two of these. We got some celery, some green onions. We got a baby carrot. Baby. Two tomatoes. We got some red delicious apple. Have some bite? Pretty good, huh? Yep. Lettuce. Some apple cider vinegar. We like the one with the mother. It's the raw unfiltered. And the mother is this cloudy stuff at the bottom. You want to get one that has like the cloudiest bottom. Real dirty one. Yeah, <laughs> a dirty bottom. <laughs> a dirty mother bottom. <laughs> and chicken was on sale, so we got two packages of chicken. Do you know that Coke Zero Cherry Vanilla has been disappeared in this location of Canada for a very long time? And now it's back and we found it at Shoppers. We were just saying it's got to be like half a year that we've been looking for that stuff. And so we got one of those 
and we got a wild cherry diet Pepsi. It's very difficult to find this here as well. So that was exciting. So we got a double cherry, a double cherry Whopper. When we're dieting, we like live on finding new or different diet pops. Did you know that the Kylie bear yesterday got it really old? Sassmeister turned 59. 18. <laughs> 18 forever. Sassmeister turned 39 yesterday. Wow. Happy birthday, Sassmeister. Thanks. <laughs> He's my cute old muffin. <laughs> you have to add in that old part there. Yeah. Okay, he chose this chocolatey chip cookie dough briars. Yeah. Hi, buddy. And this is phase three of the fancy surprise day. All right, we got the cheat day food. This is the last portion in the grocery haul. Day three, let's have a surprise bag. All right, the friends, we got Lay's chips, plain and ketchup. I know the friends in the States, you're gonna be so sad because these are the best chips. I think ketchup's my favorite chip ever. And most friends in the States, I'm pretty sure they don't get ketchup chips. Let us know if you guys have tried it or if you have ketchup chips. Yeah, because if you haven't, if you ever get your hands on those, do it. Get and your hands on them and eat them too. <laughs> and then lick your fingers. Yeah, oh yeah, you gotta lick your fingers of the ketchup chips. Plain Lay's for the sour cream dipping. French onion. It's French onion, but see, you know what sauce? It says sour cream dip on it. It's French onion. It's hell of a good dip, and it is French onion. And if you never had it, it's a super good. This is Nicole's favorite chip. Plain, boring. <sighs> Sassy. Actually, plain ruffles, to be exact. Let us know your, pl your plain chip. Let us know your favorite chip flavor down below. What else we got in the we bag? Got don't show them, it's a surprise. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Sassy, you're being cheating. Uh-oh, I'm breaking stuff. Okay, look at this, we got sandwiches. This is for, for the Sassmeister's <laughs> birthday lunch. Summer sausage, it was his favorite choice of meat and some fancy fresh Kaiser buns. And to go with that, we were living on the edge. The Sassmeister never gets cheese to go on his sandwich. Look at this. We got some cheese. Some marble. Wow. I'm excited for that. Me too. And then, well, baby carrots is not for cheat day lunch. <laughs> we were running low. And then, hmm, I, so, I don't know what to show to friends next. Fat-free cheese slices for our meals during the week. This is a new flavor. This is, um... How do they say it? Orange cream pop. Look, it's got filling inside. And Sassmeister's not a candy friend. However, he is just as excited as me to try these. I love candy, so I'm ready. I used to love those cream sickles as a kid. I think these are going to be so good. All right. Then we found another new food that just came to Canada. Strawberry shortcake cookies. Wow. Look at this. It looks like it's like a a shortbread cookie or something, and then strawberry cream in the middle. Thanks, look at that. Oh, you already are, okay. <laughs> I'm pretty excited about these. You know what else though? They had root beer float flavor. Cookies? Yeah, uh -huh. and lime. I thought about the root beer ones, I really did. But then I thought, I probably wouldn't eat the whole bag. Next thing you know, it'll be the beer without the root. <laughs> and the friends, I saved the best for last. The little mini donuts. These are extremely hard to find here. We used to get them all the time, and now you can't find the mini donuts with the three flavors at the stores. So these were from Sobeys, and they got the chocolate-covered vanilla ones, they got the cinnamon sugar ones, and then the powdered sugar ones. These are like my all-time favorite donuts. When Grocery we, store donuts. When we seen these, we were like, oh, yes, my long-lost friend. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to hit the bell for notifications so you don't miss any fancy videos. Check us out on Instagram and TikTok at the Colettes. Like and subscribe if you didn't already. And have a great day. And check out our weight loss guides if you would like them. They are down below the link. And fancy fight for a gear like I was wearing in some of the extravaganza. Check out the link down below if you want some. 
Have a great day. Thanks for watching. We love you. Peace out, dudes. Colats out. See ya. See ya. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it.